To begin this little project, I first picked up a tool to remove a freewheel. Picked up a freewheel, a nice mega range one. And a seven speed trigger shifting lever to replace the twist shifter that was currently on the bike. Here I'm just using a little bit of canned air to remove both of these slide on grips. I have some old lock ons to replace these with. And for the right hand side, you'll need a longer grip anyways because of the longer distance between the brake shifting lever from the end of the handlebar. Now we're just going to shift the bike and do 7th gear so that the rear wheel will be a little bit easier to take off when the time comes. The Alta 7 speed shifter that we got came pre-installed with a cable so we're just gonna cut the end off this one and get it ready to pull out from the front of the handlebars. We are gonna completely remove the twist shifter at this point. I'm now removing the brake lever, as I like to have my shifter on the other side of it. It just makes for a more comfortable cockpit setup for me. You just gotta love getting cheap parts off eBay. Now we're just going to take our 15mm socket and remove the rear wheel. After laying the chain on the axle, I put some tension on the tensioning arm of the derailleur and then just try and finagle the tire out. I'm using the freewheel tool with an adjustable wrench, so I was just putting one of the axle nuts back on the end to keep the tool in place while I tried to twerk it out. As you'll see, it requires quite a bit of force.
Yeah, it's pretty much free at this point. I don't know why I keep spinning it. You could tighten this with just your chain and pedals, but I went ahead and tightened it with the wrench before throwing it back on the bike. If you do have an extra person to help you with this part, I'd recommend it. It's a bit finagly to do while holding the bike and one hand and trying to get the chain to seat on the other. I'm also applying an even force down over the back tire on the frame just to make sure that the axle seat evenly in their holders. The shifter cable kept getting stuck on the end of this housing cable, so took it off, put it back on later. And now here I'm just tightening this and then moving it out three clicks for later adjustment of the derailleur.
Now I'm just pulling this cable as taut as I can and tightening it down. <laughs> 